Excuse my language, any parents and family, any any of y'all. That's on here, okay? The miracle debut if I get a bag in my get blue. Brother told me invest the money we accrue, yeah. Put my pops on the job top and let them fool. If it's in the Bible, I can promise it come true. It's a miracle debut. You could be mad at What's up everybody? It's Tiffany and I'm back with another video. So today, what I see you can see by the title, right? Hold on. I'm gonna be doing unpopular opinions um a lot of y'all y'all about to hate me for real after this video but do i care no i don't care so i wrote it down in this book right here um first i'm having opinion boys who sag oh my god this is like every boy at my school majority of them it is not cute it is not cute to sag it's not cute to show your booty like it's really really not because i always say it's a lot of gay boys at my school. And you supposed to be straight. So you just let all the gay boys look at your booty. Okay, so you must like boys looking at your booty. But that's just me. Okay? Next. Beehivers, don't come for me. Don't come for me because I ain't sent for you. Okay? Okay. Um, Beyonce is not the best singer ever. Like, she's good. She's a great performer. She can't, she got a voice and stuff. But y'all just be talking about her like she is God. Like, she made the earth. And baby, calm down. Because she gonna die just like us one day. Like, relax. Y'all be doing a real lot. Y'all be doing a lot, lot. Like, y'all be doing a lot, a lot, a lot about her. And she don't even know y'all for her to, for y'all to be on her tip like that. You know what I'm saying? So, calm down. Like, and to me, it's like artists that's better than her to me. Like, she not just the bestest of the bestest of the bestest. Because if you, um like, say something about Beyonce at school, they on your ass. You can't be on my ass because I don't really care about you. You feel me? I don't care about your opinion. And you can't cancel me, period. So, yeah. That's the next one. Okay. I feel like this is not really a popular, unpopular opinion. Most girls feel like this anyway. Daughter should not be treated differently from her brother's point blank period i don't care what nobody say i don't care what no parents say you should not let your son run around here being a little thought pocket but you want your daughter to be all conservative like they didn't come from the same household okay if you treat your daughters how they supposed to be treated and if you treat your sons how they supposed to be treated they both won't come out right okay if you treat one better than the other or one different than the other one is gonna come out wrong okay period they're gonna come out wrong because, like, a lot of dudes, especially dads, they be thinking, like, oh, they can't let their daughter do certain things. Like, I've met people that's like, oh, the daughter is, like, the same age as the son. Or, like, they a year apart, but the son is just out there being a little thotty. Little thought body. But the daughter couldn't even go on the first date. But one sixteen and one seventeen, like girl, no. And what, like, mm -mm. that's not fair to your child. Don't ever do that, parent. Like, listen to me for real, cause your daughter, she's gonna rebel at the end of the day. She gonna feel like, oh, like I'ma do what I wanna do. You letting them do what they wanna do. You know what I'm saying? It's not, it's no good thing. It's not gonna end well. Okay, okay. The next thing, y'all gonna say I'm nasty. I like V8 juice. The tomato kind. I'm going to put a picture up so I know what I'm talking about. The tomato kind. I like the fruit, fruit one too. But I really like the tomato one. Like the regular original V8 juice. I really mess with that. Heavy on the heavy. Okay? Heavy on the tomato. Next. Y'all. Rest in peace. To do. But. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Pop smoke songs. Cringy is. Okay? They just so cringy. Why do he say stuff like that? Like, he'll say something like, yeah, she, uh, you, she know I'm handsome. Like, I, I just, he just cringy. Like, I'm a, I don't know. When I first heard his real song, like, I was feeling it, you know, on, um, social media. When he was on TikTok, everybody doing a little dance, da 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 right? Then, I heard the song in real life. And I'm like, mm -mm, I'm not messing with it. He just like cringy, like just cringy, you know? So yeah, he's cringy. 
Okay, you should be able to check your partner's phone. I don't care what nobody say. This is an unpopular opinion to me because a lot of people be saying like, oh, I don't want to see my partner's phone. I don't want to see what's in there. Oh, I'm going to be blinded. Like, no, nigga. If you're my nigga, if you're my nigga, you belong to me. Let me stop playing. <laughs> but for real, you shouldn't have nothing in your phone that I don't want to see. Now, it's different from if you're just talking to a nigga. That means if I'm talking to you, that means, and we're not exclusive, I can have niggas in my phone. You might want to see what's going on in there, and you can have girls in your phone. But I'm talking about when you're in a, in a committed relationship. Committed? Committed? Like, committed. That means, like, it's no, it shouldn't be nothing going on in your phone looking crazy. So if I go in there and I see something looking crazy, I'm done. It shouldn't be like, no... I done heard girls say, like, oh, I would never go on my man's phone because I don't know what I'm going to find. This, that, that's not your man, then. Because if it's my man, I'm going to find what I need to find. And some people are like, oh, if you go looking, you're going to find. No. Like, if somebody said, go look for the keys in the house and the keys is not in the house, you're not going to find the damn keys. They're not in the house. Like, come on now. It, no. If I look and I don't find nothing, that means it was nothing there. And if I look and I found something, that means he did some this stuff that he wasn't supposed to do. That's just that, that, and that. Like, don't, y'all, don't teach our daughters that. Like, that's the dummy joint I ever heard. Next, okay. Um, It's not cool to scam, y'all. Okay, I know this little scamming trend going on, and everybody want to be a scammer. Everybody, grandma and their mom and their auntie and their uncle want to be a scammer. Okay? But scamming is not okay, y'all. It's still a crime. It's still wrong. You're taking innocent people money. Then you don't know what who who money you taking. You feel what I'm saying? And then it's all different type of scamming. You some people just take random people money. You could have just took like a mother of five, you know, a single mother of five last bit of money she needed for rent or last bit of money she needed for her light bill. You see what I'm saying? But you want to scam people. That's disrespectful. Like no, that's not cute at all. No scamming is right at all. Period, but you know, I don't, I don't like that. I don't like it at all, okay? I look down upon scammers. I don't care, period. It's wrong, it's wrong, it's wrong. Because if you take my money, we're going to have a problem. Like, I'm going to find you for real. Next, okay. Yo, okay. <laughs> I hate, yo, I, I don't care. I hate girls who talk country. And I'm not talking about, like, the Alabama country. No, I love those. I'm talking about, like, the ghetto, like, Atlanta girl country i'm not gonna lie to you i live in atlanta but i'm from jersey and like when i hear atlanta girls talk it just sound retarded like i'm yo <laughs> please don't come for me i don't even mean to be disrespectful i just hate it i just hate it so much and i mean like the really loud obnoxious ones they be like yeah what you time bad like stop that shit okay stop like stop talking like that stop like stop for real because it's not cute all girls in atlanta do not talk like that but just the ones that you know they like real obnoxious real loud like da -da 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 -da, like yeah like mm -mm. don't talk like that no more stop that okay okay um this another big one people are really gonna be on my head about black people can be racist okay everybody can be racist anybody can be racist i know a lot of people like oh it's systematic it's like us the system is against us the system might be against us like yeah that's true but racism is purely on the person at hand okay it's a person individually it's me okay it's you individually it's your friend individually it's your mom individually it's how you feel about a race individually it's not how the system feels about your race or how the system is messing with your race you see what i'm saying it's not just about the system it's about you to a hand because um, i'm sorry to tell you but when god come on judgment day and he be like you know i know the system was against you no he gonna say what is in your heart did you hate people kk okay racism is just hating someone because of their skin color period that's what it is and black people can hate people because of their skin color you can even hate yourself you can even hate your own kind but that's a whole nother conversation y'all but yes black people can be racist fight me i don't care okay um Ninth and 10th graders should not be able to come 
to 11th and 12th grade prom. They need to wait their turn. I don't care what nobody say. If you got a little boyfriend and girlfriend in 10th grade, 9th grade, um, you need to grow up. I'm sorry. Okay? Okay. They look too young. You look too old. You about to go to college. You about to leave. They still going to be here. They're going to be young. Too young. Wait for them to get older. They're youngish. They still going through puberty. Okay? Okay. Um. Yo. It's not good to smoke weed. This is my next unpopular opinion. It's not good to smoke weed. I don't like smoking weed. I don't smoke weed. Um, I don't like people who really... It's not... I, it's not my, I'm not going to say I don't like people who don't smoke... I mean, who smoke weed. I'm not going to say I don't like them. I just don't think it's good to smoke weed. Because I got friends that smoke weed, but I don't approve of like them smoking weed. Not saying anything about approval. It's more like... I'm not like, yeah, it's like you smoke weed. That's cool. Like, nah. It's not cool to me. Okay, it's not cool to smoke weed, and it's like a big, big wave, and it's f probably forever gonna be a big wave. But like, I feel like when you need something to cope, then it's bad for you. You should be able to cope on your own. And most people, especially like the kids in my age range and stuff, they don't know how to cope without weed. When they get mad, when they get sad, when they're getting any type of emotion, they wanna go smoke some weed. So now you can't cope without weed. So now that's a problem because you should be able to cope just as a person without any substance at all so that's what i feel about weed um i got a couple more than i'm almost done um cops are not bad y'all cops are not bad all cops are not bad okay stop teaching your kids to f12 okay that's wrong at the end of the day like it's wrong okay because if somebody rob your house and you're not living that life life, like if you're not living that gangster, smakester, gangster life, and somebody rob your house, you're going to call the cops, okay? You're going to call the cops. Stop lying like you're not going to call the cops. You're going to call the cops, okay? If somebody shoot up your house and you're not living that type of lifestyle, you're going to call the cops. Unless you like a big drug dealer and you know you really bout it, da -da -da -da, you're going to call the cops, okay? So stop playing them games. I mess with 12. I date a 12. I marry a 12, okay? Hold on. Yes, I'll, I will. I like 12. I mess with 12, heavy on the 12, as long as they mess with me. You mess with me, I mess with you. For me, like, I don't like 12 who really a-holes. It's good cops and bad cops, just like it's good people and bad people. I'm not gonna stereotype them because of what they got on. Now, do they make me feel nervous sometimes? Yes. Because of everything going on, I don't know who the good cop and who the bad cop, but I'm not gonna just like say like, oh, F12, all of them are bad. And I will not defund the police because if there is no law, everything will be chaotic. Like, if there's no police, everything is going to be crazy here. It's, niggas is really going to be crazy. Like, niggas already crazy. Like, people got, you know, people was getting stabbed up at my school. Imagine, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they be, they be wild. Like, they be wild. So, we still do need cops. We just need better cops. And I feel like if we keep telling our kids, like, F12, then no more black kids are going to want to be cops anymore. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be really all the white people being cops. And, like, there's nothing wrong with white people being cops, but it's a lot of racist white people. Like, it's a lot of white people who don't like black people. That's true. And if they all cops and you teaching your kid not to F with 12, they're not going to want to be a cop. They're not going to want to be on our side. And I feel like we need more people in that position on our side and not on the opposing side. Not saying like it's side. You y'all know what I'm saying, bro. Dang. Okay, next. Yo, this is huge. Okay. Okay. My light was acting dumb. Yo, I can't see. <laughs> but anyway, cuz they like blinding me. But anyway, them crystals don't do shit, okay? I'm sorry to tell you they're rocks. They don't do nothing. They do nothing at all. They do sh nothing at all. They don't do anything. They have no power, okay? I'm sorry to let you know. I'm sorry to bust your bubble. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Them, okay? Them little crystals, they don't do nothing. The moon, do not do nothing. The stars, don't do nothing. Jupiter, don't do shit. Fuck them. Excuse my language, any parents and family, any any of y'all that's on here, okay? I need to put that in front of the video. 
but they don't do nothing. Stop believing that crap. All right, let me hurry up and finish this video. Finish this video. My phone be acting retarded. What is wrong with this phone, bro? Anyway, this last one. I don't think face masks work. I just don't think covering your face like this with some with some thin piece of cloth is going to keep you from getting a very, very dangerous virus. All right, that's the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that, all that. If you disagree with me, you can say it in the comments, but don't be disrespectful because I will delete your comment and block you on whatever else I can do in this little thing, okay? Bye.